What's up guys, it's RB here. So today we are going to be discussing Fontana Dam, pretty much everything about it, where we're at with the game right now, the problem we've had, which is why nothing's really gotten done or has been shown in the Discord server, uh, j just stuff like that. Basically everything there is to know about what we're doing with this game right now. So uh, yeah, let's get right into the video. So I thought we would start off, you know, on a good subject, a good topic, and that is the map, which of course we bought this map pretty much fully complete uh all the ed assets had to be removed from it so we had to replace some buildings for example the hospital which this probably does not fit i built that and it, it really does not fit that probably needs to be changed but you know the map is fully done There's, all the buildings are now back in place and stuff like that some of them will be changed i see the church isn't over there anymore so that needs to be built sorry i lied but for the most part the map is like 95 percent done and then on top of that yeah just basically anything map related it is basically done so that's the good news and on top of that while we're on this topic i have a question you guys like ambient music just in sort of random areas this is just something we were experimenting with just like you know we have this boom box playing some music at the coffee shop i don't know just something we were experimenting with if that's something cool let me know but yeah so that's the good news the map is really done i mean it already was done but it's it's fully good to go so now let's talk about the bad news and what's been holding us back cars we all love them that's why you play the car game and there's a giant issue with them going on on roblox so here's some of the cars that have been imported that are just kind of sitting here we have some more some more normal ones in other places whatever but the problem and these will not be here when the game comes out this is just to fill up the parking see what it looks like the problem with cars right now is obviously there's so much so many issues going on with the licensing you have games like Driving Up Higher licensing smaller car brands, so then you can't use those car brands anymore because they'll get mad at you. Their cars, like, because Driving Up Higher paid money, right, for the licensing. So you're more likely to, for somebody to report it to Driving Up Higher and then Driving Up Higher would show it to the car company so you get in trouble. Or like, you can't use a Lamborghini in your game because that'll get found out and Roblox might delete your game. Just the licensing thing right now, is a giant headache and i don't fully understand none of us fully understand it i don't know if anybody except like maybe boldex and top driving games fully understand it but the problem is we don't we can't license cars we we don't make enough money for that we don't make any money from this game we're not rich none of us are multi-millionaires in real life who can just uh go up to lamborghini and be like all right we'll send you 100 grand if you let us use your cars in our game you know we're all like broke college students or in that area of life that age so it's a giant problem and that's why there hasn't been any progress reports and why we've kind of we just haven't done anything to this game really for the past month because we are trying to figure out what to do because so many of these cars can get the game taken down on top of that the cars that will be safe at least for now are unknown and nobody really cares about because there's no personal attachment and that's kind of the problem with fake car models too it's like everybody knows what a mercy lago is for example and a lot of people love this car so that's like an inspiration that that's why you want to play the game is to drive your favorite cars whereas we look at this car right here which is the uh Caspita something or whatever i forget the name nobody really knows what this car is so you don't have that connection with it and so it's not as motivating to play the game for so on that subject i guess let me know if you guys are cool with obscure supercars sports cars and stuff because that's probably what will make up the majority of what's in the game should this game come out. And then on top of that, the other problem is we want this game to have a bunch of cars for everybody. You know, a bunch of just normal cars as well. And uh, there's not many normal cars that are super unknown and that won't get you in trouble. They're all mass produced. So it's been a massive headache. And that's what's keeping this game back more than anything. And that's why I don't know if this game will come out, truth be told. We want to get it out, but until we can figure out something to do with the licensing, or something to do with the cars because we're not doing fake models absolutely not until we can find a good thing to do with the cars we're, we're basically kind of stuck so uh, if you have any ideas let us know in the comments or something like that if you're okay with fake car models not fake car models sorry lesser known car models mostly in the game let us know but uh yeah we just don't want to get sued we don't want to deal with roblox uh, banning any of our accounts because some of us uh, use our Roblox accounts for other things money related, which is weird to say that you can, you know, do your business from Roblox, but you sort of can. So that's some of my friends. So it, it's been a giant mess, but that's where we're at right now. And I know people point out games like Midnight Racing have cars, but I do think that is really just only a matter of time before they get 
you know, they're no longer allowed to use those cards. Whether the game gets temporarily taken down, permanently taken down, they get sued. That's pretty unlikely. But something will happen. You know, it's not going to last forever. So, uh, yeah, that's the cards, and that's the biggest issue. Now let's move on to issue number two. That's not that big, but still isn't. All right, next issue, scripting. Obviously, we're not stupid. We bought the game with a scripter. One of the guys who bought the game with us was a scripter. And uh, he was a friend of one of my friends who bought the game. One of the only people I wasn't friends with when we bought the game. And uh, he kind of just dipped the project. I don't know if my friend and him had a falling out or whatever. There's no ill will towards him or anything. He's just never on and never does anything and never seems to care and nobody can get responses out of him. So uh, we don't have a scripter right now. Kind of a problem because it turns out you need those. As you can see, we literally have just the toolbox spawner in here right now to test cars. So uh, that's pretty fun. We will get a scripter or we'll just pay somebody to do the one-off systems. Obviously for a driving game, you don't need anything too crazy. You need data saving. You need uh, cash and then miles and then a dealership and then we'll try and have like a basic customization shop on release too or not try we will you know paint colors and stuff like that on release this game's not gonna have jobs or anything that's something we would love to add in the future but i don't know if that'll happen you know ever but it, it should if the, if we do end up releasing this game and working on it uh on top of that one of the people in our discord server bought Kuratuk with the intention of it being one day like joined in with this map as in like you know sort of how ud had multiple maps you could play that same way um i think that's still going ahead i don't know i haven't talked to that guy in a little bit he's been busy with real life stuff so for anybody wondering about that yeah that is still thing but that map we haven't touched or anything so that would not be on release on top of that the fontana dam revamp map the fall map also will not come on release we haven't really worked on that map either so if that map comes out that'll be in the future as well anyway. all right the final issue we're having right now with development simple it's it's time we're all busy like i've said in this video multiple times we're either college students or working on careers right so it's a matter of we we can't spend all day every day working on fontana dam because it's not a job it doesn't pay anything there's no way one can justify just sinking all of your time into this game so that's 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 another problem of why we're uh, why this game just isn't out yet you know we don't have time to work on it all day on top of that something i do want to address really quick is we we messed up announcing this game as early as we did we expected it to be out which i've just explained all these factors that have you know, pushed it back over and over again i don't want to whatever people in the discord server seem to think that because it's taking so long this is going to be some amazing masterful game and it's going to be the best driving game you've ever played I would just like to say to all the people who are like getting extremely hyped over this game, just kind of don't. It's not that it will be a bad game on release, but we bought this game not intended, not intending to make it the greatest game ever. This is just supposed to be like a fun, back to basics, grassroots sort of 2017, 2018 driving game for you. So I just want to put that out there right now. Don't expect some game with crazy races crazy customization the best car sounds you've ever heard the best map you've ever seen though this map is really good shout out to index so this thing i want to put out there is don't overhype yourself because you're going to be disappointed but i certainly hope all of you will like whatever it is we put out at the end of the day i'm not even sure what it's going to be anyways now let's get on to future plans or future wh whatever you want to call it so the future release dates stuff like that i'm going to try and cover this that now in this section so release date something so many people have bothered us about i wanted i've had so many release dates in my head i wanted to get it out by my birthday my birthday's tomorrow that's not gonna happen this needs to be anchored okay um so release date we don't have one anymore we used to try and name them we don't have one it, it's out when it's out uh we'll obviously give everybody like an, a, an announcement we'll have it done and then we'll just set it the release date for like a week or whatever i don't know but uh, yeah, there's no official release date for this game or anything like that. Sorry. I hope it'll be done soon. I, I really do hope it'll be done soon. It doesn't need tons of work even. We have most of the car models we need. We really just need the scripter and then we need to figure out what we do with licensing if we don't keep those current car models. And then a fair amount of cars have to be chassis somewhere on chassis, but that's not a giant deal. It's more the sounds of our band. So overall, it's not that the game's close, but it's also not super far because we don't want to accomplish a ton with it you know we're not out here trying to add like crazy game breaking crazy just new all new innovative game systems is, is what i'm trying to say so the game is fairly close i guess but it just depends on our time 
what we end up doing with the cars and scripting all that stuff if you're a scripter and you're interested in scripting for this game or whatever let me know in the comments or hit me up on discord which is venom rv or go to our discord server uh, the problem is we're not trying to make money off of this game and so that's kind of what's killed a lot of the scripting and people who would like to work for us is this game is not trying to be monetized so just know that i guess but yeah so the game where it's at i don't know when it'll come out hopefully sooner than later it's not it's it's most likely not going to be like next month or something i would really love to get it out sooner than later but it's just you know life man like it's in the way but i hope that answers all the questions everybody has if you have any questions whatsoever concerning the game drop them in the comments i'll respond to any comment any question ask as many questions as you want uh any feedback anything at all let me know down in the comments or you can let all of us know in the discord server whatever you want thank you all for watching i'll see you all in the next one then i'm out oh also i should mention anything you see in this video like these cars right here that are you know really goofy and funny they might not make it into the final version of the game as in this is definitely not getting into the final version of the game so uh yeah and like this spot basically stuff subject to change so uh, don't get all riled up over nothing Anyways, see ya. Bye.